What do you think? So how do I go really slow? Well, you got to get on it. Well, I know. I just want to see how, like, touchy it is. <laughs> I feel, you know? I'm give it a, Give it a little gas. See, it goes slow. Okay, go down the go down the hill. I'm not going all the way down. Yeah, we're gonna go on the road. Let's do it. Hey, Dad, but that's too scary. The brakes were good, and yeah, it's got a brake light. I like that. excited about your new new ride? Oh yeah. I like my new helmet. Oh yeah. Oh. Station for a little later. Brought all the chargers. Um, let's try in the DC. This should be your charger, Summer. got all of our water so we better stay close to her. You ready? The tires on Summers aren't quite as big, the High Boy uh, Ecom 14, but it seems to be handling the grass pretty well. We're never going to keep up with her. What's your favorite part about these? Everything. I love them. <laughs> I like that they're quiet. I like that I don't have to pedal. I love that we can go on trails. Yeah, me too. So maybe that's the, the biggest benefit is that today it's 90 <laughs> and I'm not, we're not pedaling. We can still go for a bike ride, so that's cool. You gotta wait for us, Summer. We're slow old people. I've been riding for 12 minutes, Dad. How fast does how fast does yours go? I think 22 or 23. 22? <laughs> Have you gone that fast yet? I've only gone 20. Okay. That's pretty fast. That's pretty fast, especially on blacktop. Don't go that fast on blacktop. Yeah, <laughs> we don't want to do that. All right, so this is more dirt trail. Let's see, let's see how it handles. <laughs> Community gardens coming along pretty good. Quite a bit, uh, quite a bit growing in there. Got to haul water back here, so <laughs> got water up in an IBC tote, just gravity fed out to water the garden out here. I have my pedal assist on. It's working. Are you actually head. pedaling though? I'm pedaling. Yeah. Convenient. That's perfect. <laughs> so we got you a. A scooter because you they don't really make the the e-bikes i haven't seen one that's small enough for you yeah um and you can turn it's like if you like can turn the speed um, okay so it has like three different speed levels mm -hmm. so it tells you how fast you're going how long you've been riding where's your battery level it's got a little and then if you hold down this top button oh that's your it headlight. turns on the headlight that's Which cool. And I like yours because it has a flashing um, brake light. Yeah. So right back there, it kind of lets you know when you're pushing the brakes, which is nice. And I More visible on the roads. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so this one actually folds up. So the there's a clip right here. Just take this latch off, and then this whole thing folds down. So you can actually, I mean, it gets pretty small. You could put that in the back of a, a trunk of a car. Mm -hmm. So this is your accelerator. So it's a thumb, a thumb accelerator. <laughs> So it's yeah, nice. It's a, it's a good size for you. So how old are you, Summer? Eleven. Eleven years old. So Summer is eleven, and and this is uh, safe for her, I think. And 
So the, hers goes up to what, 2022. Ours have, I mean, I've been almost 28 on mine. I think yours is like 25, maybe? I might have gone up to 11. 11? <laughs> you you don't drive as fast as we do. Yeah. So you can actually, I mean, you can use this as a regular scooter and just stand on it and mm. drive it if you want. Or yeah, you could, and you can actually move the seat up and down. So uh -huh. it'll go up and a And the higher. handlebars, and it has a quick stand, so like, you know. Yep. This is the best thing about trail riding right here. Blackberries. I want all of these. <laughs> That's good. Can I run over the cord right here? Yep. It's so smooth. <laughs> this is what we do in the church when no one's here. This is so scary. Hey, I need a water. You need a water? Yeah, can I get a water out of there? Thanks. It's time to go. Time to go, yeah. It's time to go. Sorry. We've been out here for one hour and 36 minutes, and this is the battery. Look at it. We've been out here for one hour and 36 minutes, and that's the battery. It only went down so like two bars. So it's like, yeah, 75% or 70%. That's mm -hmm. good. We'll load it up and we can actually, if we're going a longer distance or going to another park or something, I can use that uh, uh, battery bank to charge these on the road, which is kind of nice. But we're just heading home for today, so. It's a snapper for sure. It's definitely a snapper. Yeah, it's tail. Do you see that tail? The worst stinking animal. Is it hurt? What? Do you like riding this out here? Kind of. Is it hard on the dirt road? Is it harder? Yeah, like on like loose gravel, it kind of. Is. It's on loose gravel, but it's it does like go. That. It goes pretty good on gravel, but you just need to get used to it. Yeah. You gotta toughen up, kid. Drive fast. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> so hard. Can't handle. You're doing great. <laughs> I think there's a baby. Hold on. Summer, it's a mom and a baby, I think. It's pouring rain. It's not pouring, it's sprinkling. Look, I'm not even getting a drop of my finger yet. Look, look at my hand. It's not, that's in. And you still want to go riding? You don't ever want to stop? Ever? Ever. The electric bikes have uh, quickly become uh, one of our favorite things to do here uh, in the summertime. And uh, living out here on dirt roads in the country is, is awesome because we can just kind of head out. Sometimes my wife and I will just uh, head off and, and take a, uh, an hour and, and just kind of cruise around the back roads. Uh, now that Summer has this scooter, uh, she can come with us, uh, or her and I, or her mom and, and her can kind of go for rides during the day as well. The, the struggle for, for Summer, Summer is 11 years old, and it has been hard to find an electric bike that for kids, other than real little kids or, or adults. And the, the electric bikes are fairly tall, so it's hard to get on them. She has just absolutely love. She begs us every day to go up to the church and ride the parking lot, ride the trails, or to, to go out on the roads here. 
And uh, that little high boy scooter has been uh, has been awesome for her. She has just loved it. She's happy, um, and she's been missing out. When when Lisa and I would go out on the road, you know, and, and leave her behind, she was very sad. Hopefully, you guys uh, enjoy just a little uh, taking you guys along for just something we do to have a little fun around here. Uh, we actually love these e-bikes and there'll be more to come on some other electric bike things. I'm going to do some review videos, I think, comparing some of the different models and what to look for because they are an expensive investment and uh, I think it's it's wise to, uh, a few things to consider when you're before you buy one. So High Boy has been a good brand and we have uh, another brand that we're going to be looking at here uh, in the next few weeks. Let me know what you guys think of the, uh, the High Boy scooter and uh, the e-bike, the whole e-bike thing. Do you think e-bikes are just going to replace everything as these e-bikes come down in price I, I don't see them going anywhere I think they're just going to become more and more popular and we're going to start to see them them everywhere they are uh, certainly a lot of fun as always guys thanks for watching have a good one